What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Bugs, back. Yo, guys, finally, they dropped the stub sale, guys. As per usual, drop um, tell whatever you want in the comments for a chance of winning 10k, uh, 100 likes on the vid. Give a guy uh, 100 likes on the vid, give a guy a random 10k in the comments. So, like up the vid, man, so we'll get 10k as long as it hits 100 likes. Um, make sure you comment for a chance of winning it. Anyways, guys, um, guys, if you listened to me the last week, I said stay strong. They're going to drop a stub sale. I'm telling you, bro. The, the market, when it gets that low, MLB freaking tweaks, and they drop a stub sale. And I actually haven't even looked at it. I just got home from work. I'm, I, it literally looks like I got punched in the eye. Like, I don't even know how that's possible. It literally looks like I got knocked out. But, yeah, the stub sale's at 40%. Guys, the market has been revived. For all you all you guys freaking out saying you guys need to sell your players, I was like, yo, just chill out, chill out. It's going to be okay. They're going to bless us, and they're going to drop a stub sale. Just wait. The market's too low. Just wait, just wait, just wait. What happens? They drop the stub sale. Everybody's going wild. We're all going to make stubs. I'm about to make about 300K stubs. Um, I told everybody to invest. As you can see, I have zero stubs. It is time to make the freaking stubs. I'm so excited. Um... So, so I'm telling you, you do all the cards you got. Go ahead and sell them. If they drop any other packs, the market's gonna crash. Go ahead and sell every stitch card you got, everything right now. Okay, that's all I'm gonna say. I'm selling every single diamond card. You might see me with like 300 something k stubs, maybe even more. Bro, this Lou Brock was at 30k. I'm gonna go over in this video all the prices that went up. And what you could have got them at because wow, this is absolutely crazy. Um, wow, everybody went up like 20k diamond wise. All the diamonds went up 20k. That, like, all right, let's get into it. All right, first off, bro, Vlad Jr. for 70k, he's now 90. This dude right here was 20k, now he's 25. CC was 60, 66. Upton was 45, he's 55. ED's about the same, Batan's about the same, Madden Lee went up 5, Tribe Hafner went 5, he was 10k, yo, this car was 10k, he's 15, uh, Murray went up 5, Vlad Guerrero on my video was 20, he was about 30k, now he's 36, Banks about the same, Mazeroski didn't really go up that much, this Ford dude went up 3k, Gordon went up a little bit, Ariado went up a little bit, Dawson went up 5k, no, Dawson went up 6k since my last vid, Yo, Yelich went up about 15 to 20k. He was about 60-ish k. He's literally 88, maybe even more than 20k. Um, I still can't believe it looks like I got punched in my eye. What is that? I guess I need sleep or something. Um, anyways, Arnado went up a ton. Andrew Jones went up a ton. Max Scherzer went up 20k. Uh, I heard Chris Sale was really expensive. Let me check that out. Whoa, I wish I didn't sell. Chris Sale is at 73k, yo, I lost like 20k on him, I sold him for 49, he's 73, big L, by bugs, um, Jimenez is about the same, Ryu went up a little bit, oh my goodness, it's about to be a movie, guys, listen, if you're watching this, I'm gonna do a video, I'm just gonna show you all players that went up and who you should sell, and then I'm gonna do an aftermath of the market inflation, um, that'll probably be a video Monday, but yo, Bellinger went up 8k, Oh my goodness. I Bugs is so happy right now. 7k Freeman went up. Um Anderson went up a lot. Devers. Oh my god. Devers even went up. Devers about a bit 42. Get the frick off my team, you bum. I cannot stand you. Holy crap. I've been waiting to sell this Devers for so long. You know who I want to check right now? I want to check Hector Neris, bro. Hector Neris. Yo, Altuve went up 6k. He was 14k. Machado went up 10k. He was 26k uh, about three days, two days ago. Um, let's see. Hector Neris. Oh my goodness. God bless America, yo. Look at that. He's about to hit 48. Oh my goodness, yo. I still lost a ton of stubs off him because I could have sold him at 100. But still, yo. Wow, that's crazy. Um, let's see. Kershaw. Kershaw's 32.9. Wow, Kershaw was 18. That is insane. Glaber was 20. Now he's 29. Um, let's see. Austin Riley, he was, yeah, he's about the same. Kluber. Kluber went up about 10K. Chapman went up 10K. Uh, we got Baez went up about 10K. 
You're gonna see buys price probably go up like he usually does. Um, you could wait on buys. Um, Edwin Diaz went up five six k. JD went up three k. I want to check Chris Bryant. Okuna went up two k. Pete Alonso. <gasps> Wow, whoever bought this card at 13 10, around 13 to 10k, he's 40k now. Oh my goodness. I wish I should have did it. Um if you guys bought at 12 13k, people were asking me to buy Pete Alonso. He was so cheap. Look at his price now. I actually can't believe. If you bought this Pete Alonso, you're a stuff millionaire. If you bought freaking 5 of them, you literally made 30k clean a pop. You, you literally made 150k stubs off 50k. You literally tripled your stubs. Congratulations. Wow. That was the biggest snag on the market that I saw. And I couldn't get it because I had absolutely no stubs. I didn't want to sell anything. Chris Bryant was actually 13k yesterday. He's now 20. God bless. I have four. Um, Some of them will be leaving. I cannot see any of these in my collection anymore or because I'm going to have a heart attack. I've been holding on these Chris Bryants for about a week and a half now. And oh my god, it's sick, man. Get out of here. Um, Chris Bryan's out. Garrett Cole. Yo, Dietrich. If you have Dietrich, you took a dub. He's 96k. He went up a ton. Chapman went up 1k. I literally, it's crazy how you probably don't think I'm right, but literally, I'm right. I remembered everybody's price. I do this every day, yo. This is what I do. Harper went up 10k. Harper was at 20k base, 16k sell. The fact that the market went up this much is crazy. I'm so excited right now. It doesn't sound like it because I'm absolutely shot, but wow. Yo, Yates. Yo, Yates. Told you guys to invest him in at 2K like two weeks ago. He went diamond. He's at 7K now. I bought seven. Some of them could leave. Um, I'm going to sell some of mine because I need stubs, bro. Bugs is broke for too long. I, you never see Bugs is broke. Um, yeah. Let's see. We got... Hmm. Craig Kimball's at 16. Oh my god. So guys, literally, let's look at the 99s. I didn't even look. This dude right here went up 100 k Carter went up. He was at 90 k I said buy him yesterday at 90 k He's at 120 Alkali, I don't know his price exactly. I know Cal Ripken, the whole fourth inning collection, Cal Ripken, McCutcheon, and uh, who's the other one? Wagner. They were all at 50k base, 55k. They're at 75k. I told you yesterday to make sure you buy them, and today... Um, because once the stub sale drops, it's over. And look what happens. They drop these cards and good night, moon. And they are way, way up. If you listen to me, you're lucky. Um, we got Joe Votto at 70. We got Alomar 81. Ricky Ederson's at 90. Yo, ho, ho. If you guys got him at 50k, you're lit. Brown's at 45. He's at 65. All of these players that went up. Yeah, daddy. Yo, Cooper, my video was 65. He's at 90. Yeah, daddy. He's at, it was 70 something in my video. He's at 102. Wow. I, Wade Boggs in my vid was 40. He's at 60. Keith Hernandez was 15. He's at 19. Not the biggest. Monte Irvin, no one really cares about him. Uh, Larry Doe will be about the same. Realistically, all these like legends that nobody knows about, like who's Eno Slaughter? Who the hell is Larry Doby? No one knows them. They're too old for us. Um, let's see. Omar Vizquel, nobody even has yet. I don't even think you could get him yet. I don't know too much about the All-Star event, to be honest. I didn't care about it. This Michael Young was 130 in my vid. He's 190. So pretty much all the guys that are around 100K jump the most because they're the most stubs and the most rarest cards. Like this card jumps so much. Um, M Lou Brock went up a lot already. Zach Grinky went up a ton. Adam Jones actually went up a lot as well. He was 60, 75. Uh, Russell Martin. Whoa, that's a good price. If you got, if you guys are watching this, go, go scout Sue Dabber, 18.5. Um, Brian McCann, 76. That's actually lit because he went up a lot. Yo, I expected him to go up a little more actually. He's about, he didn't go up that much. He went up a little bit. Vlad went up a lot. I feel like I already said these players but guys if you're watching this make sure you sell your cards if you want to make those stubs make sure you go sell the cards that's all i really have to say just sell 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 if they ever drop those packs again just know make sure okay listen for now on make sure you have stubs on deck bro because that market crash did me dirty for about a week in the game it made me not want to do anything in the game because i had no stubs i couldn't sell when players were that low Think about it, if you sold your whole team yesterday, you lost on like triple to double the amount of stubs. Um, if you just waited like Bugs did, you made stubs like me. I hope you guys enjoyed. Make your stubs now, sell your players, enjoy your day. Hope you have a good one.
Fall, fall.